So how do you do your makeup when you only have 10 minutes? Well, I'm gonna show you today. So stay tuned because you are gonna love this look and it's not just your boring old everyday look. It does make you look super fresh with healthy skin and you're gonna love it. Now, before we head into this video, don't forget I have an online publication called Confessions of a Creative covering several different topics such as health, beauty, fashion, culture, entrepreneurship, anything that you are interested in, you will probably find on my site. It's all written by me and there are two subscription offers available. You can choose whichever one you want. One is free, you get access to some of the site. The other is paid, but only costs around a coffee a month and you get so much for it. Access to the whole site, subscriber perks and benefits, a little room where we can chat. So I know you're gonna enjoy it. So make sure you show your support there. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button so that you never miss any of my future videos. And I'm on Instagram, so don't forget to come and say hi there too. Now let's jump straight into this video. So here I am back with another 10 minute video. What was I thinking? 10 minutes, let's do another look. Let's see what this look turns out like. So every time I do a 10 minute video, like 10 minute makeup look, I try and change up the look so that it doesn't look the same. So I wanna see how much of a variety can I create so that we can see what you can create basically in 10 minutes. That was such a long way of saying it, but you know what I mean. So I've already got my skincare on. I am gonna be putting my timer on. I think the last time I did this, I forgot to put the timer on. So I had to just like guess how long it took me. That wasn't actually a 10 minute video. That was like, let's see how quick it is. Anyway, let's get started with this. So I am going to hit start in a second. Let's get this on to 10 minutes and there we go. Okay, so 10 minutes is ready to go and let's, oh, I'm already getting nervous because I'm like, <laughs> you know, okay. So um, I've, I haven't done a 10 minute video in so long that I've forgotten if I can actually do it. Let's just go for it. I'm gonna hit, <laughs> in my head, I'm trying to also figure out what my first step is. And for some reason I'm having like a full on mind blank where I'm like, what would I start with first? Anyway, I think I know what I'm doing. Anyway, let's just see what we can create. Let's hit start. Okay, so first things first, I've got my skincare on, like I said. I'm gonna use this new product. This is actually the NARS Light Reflecting Eye Brightener and I'm using the shade Golden Eye. And the reason I'm actually using this is because I have quite serious dark circles at the moment and I basically want to avoid having to put a whole load of concealer on. And this is just something that you can put on underneath or it may even suit you perfectly to just put this on on its own. I don't know, you guys will be able to be the better judge of this. Like, how does this look on? How has it eradicated my dark circles? But it definitely has brightened them. And I'm gonna put this on just in other areas as well. I mean, this says eye brightener, but I'm still using it in other places. It's a very opaque finish. So you do get that kind of like that like stiffness of product, which, which is actually good. Okay, I'm gonna use my Hourglass Dune Concealer. I've got a couple of new things that I'm trying today and I'm excited to try the products and just see whether they'll kind of like end up fitting into my whole kind of like quick makeup stash. You know, like the makeup you use when you don't have time. You know, like the multitasking stuff. How much have I got left? Eight minutes. Okay, so that's done. Now let's set this. So I'm just using my setting powder, which is my Ultra HD. Woo, from Makeup Forever. I mean, I, I feel like I have done my makeup before in 10 minutes, even like when I'm not filming. I feel like I have. Oh, I've got like stuff. Ah, uh, like on my eye. That always happens to me when I'm putting powder on. Anyway, okay. There you go. So, okay, now what I wanna do is put my uh, foundation on. Oh my God, what foundation am I gonna put? Oh yeah, this one. I'm gonna put the makeup by Mario Surreal Skin Foundation in 15N. And I've just got my brush, which is my Sigma F85. I feel like I am being a bit slow, guys. I don't feel like I'm rushing enough and this is a bit worrying. Because all I'm just like describing everything to you and it's like, get a move on, just do it. Okay. 
but I really want to be able to create some color on the skin today. Like I want to feel, I want to I want like a really nice fresh looking makeup look. But also don't want like a whole load of like base on, if you see what I mean. I just don't want like to look like I've got so much makeup on. Okay, so, okay, how much have I got? <gasps> Six minutes, 55. Okay. <sighs> what was I doing? Okay. Uh, yeah, concealer. So let's put this. There you go. And get the sponge. Come on, I should have at least got my entire base done halfway through, right? I mean, I've got to do my eyebrows, yeah, and that's the part that I usually just stick to. Like, I just, it's like a never ending eyebrow. It just, I just don't stop. Ah, oh, am I happy with that? I don't know. Let me just spread this concealer onto other areas. I feel like I just want a little bit more. I, can, I just feel like I've got a bit of darkness there, so... Oh, I'm just putting more on, guys. <laughs> I'm just putting more on. Okay. Why am I looking... I should have put the thing on my watch. It would have been easier. I think that's why I like this concealer as well, because it's one of those concealers where you can easily just, like, dot it around. Why did I say that word? Dot it around? Dot it around on your face? And, you know, you can easily wear it like that. Okay, so I want to add some sculpting. This is my Milk Multi Stick in Blaze. Milk just sent me a whole load. Why am I contouring? Why, why, why am I contouring? Uh, oh, for God's sake, why do I do this? <laughs> Okay, Milk just sent me a whole load of their stuff and it's so good, like so many nice colors. This shade is Rally and I absolutely loved it. Look how nice that is. That pink is so good. What am I doing, guys? What is wrong with me? Okay, get a sponge. Let's just do the bronzer part first. Ooh, this is nice. This stick is so good. Okay, I'm just like literally going over it all. What's going on with it? <gasps> Four minutes. Ooh, I, I really like that. I didn't think I was gonna like it. I think I completely messed it up to be honest, but, or well, when I applied it, let me just do this. That's it. It's giving me a nice kind of like sun-kissed look. Okay, let's set everything now. Oh, I feel like I'm running out of breath. Why do I feel like that? Okay, let me get rid of these lines and get this powder on. And just put this on other areas. That's it. Let's get my veil brush. Okay, and now my Real Techniques brush. Okay, I haven't got enough of my face done to feel like I'm on the right track. I've heard from a lot of you, I'm gonna just, just quickly butt into my own sex, sex sentence there. Okay, this is the Real Tech, uh, oh no, it's the Urban Decay Brow Blade in Brunette Betty. Yeah, so I'm gonna use this to do my brows. I feel like, I've heard from a lot of you guys that I stress you out when I'm doing these 10 minute videos. I'm so sorry. Three minutes, what is going on? Okay, please, please let me do good brows. Please let these brows come out good. This is the part I always just I just spend too much time on. I think I'm gonna have to ditch the brow and just come back to it if I have time. I would not be happy with going out with brows like this. 
I'm talking about like whatever I've done so far, it would be that I'd be disappointed in myself. <sighs> why did that, why is my arm hurting? Oh my God, I'm doing it again. I'm doing it again, I'm just... It's like someone's like, someone's just like forcing me to, I can't, I have to let go. Okay, oh my God, what, what? One minute 45, got an eyelash, okay. Mascara, come on, you can do it. Please let me go back to the brows. This mascara is just amazing for this, like a really quick, long, lashes okay probably the quickest mascara I've ever done okay quickly 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 let's do this I think what I was doing was spending too much time going with the pink multi stick. You know what? Let's go for it. What am I doing? Why am I doing this? I'll just go for a little bit of pink on the lids. Ooh. Oh my God, I feel like I just nearly smudged mascara on my lid. Okay, that's good. 24 seconds. Let's see if I can just do my brows a bit better. Okay, I'm just using the kind of like the pen side of this brow thing. Okay, done. That was stressful. I feel like that was more stressful than usual. Why? Why was that more stressful than usual? Like, I don't know, but I do know, but I like the look. I'm happy with this. I would go out with this. I'm actually really super, super impressed with the milk sticks. These are such good sticks. Like I'm so impressed. But yeah, that basically is my look. <laughs> I'm just literally throwing makeup everywhere. So that's my makeup. I am actually super, super impressed with, with, a, with a couple of these products. So first off, the NARS light reflecting eye brightening eye brightener. <laughs> I'm really impressed with that. First time using it, really liked it. I feel like I didn't need anywhere close to as much concealer as I usually do. I know I went back in with a bit more concealer, but I think that was more to do with having it on the cheeks a little bit more as opposed to like the under eye area. So this is really, really good. My shade is Golden Eye and I feel like it's really helped to brighten the area. I feel like if I didn't put that on, I actually think that I would look a bit more tired right now. So that's really good for brightening. I would highly recommend that. Make sure you check out the link in my description below. And then the other two products I am so, super, super impressed with are the Milk Multi multitasking sticks. They're tiny little sticks like this, right? So I love the fact that they are the smallest multitasking sticks that I have ever used. You've seen me use some other brands on here as well, which are multitasking sticks. I have to say these are amazing because the quality I would say is probably the best and it's small. It's not heavy at all and it's lightweight and there are so many colors that you can get and it's just like a very blendable stick. Not only that, it's clean makeup, it's vegan, it's hydrating. You can also, by the way, I read that you can get a thousand swipes in one stick. How awesome is that? So you don't feel like it's just going down quickly. You get to use quite a lot out of it and I'm really, I'm really, really impressed with it. I want to just add a bit more because I want to show you guys like how easy it is to blend. I'm gonna use the brush that they sent as well, which is so cute. Look at this brush. It is so cute. I should have actually used this, but I didn't. So this color, oh my God, I love it. 
See what I mean? I wanted to do this slowly so you guys can really see it, but this, this shade is Blaze and I am absolutely in love with it because I feel like it's a really good color for my skin tone. They do so many different browns, by the way, guys. So no matter what your skin tone, you're gonna find one. There are so many. So let me just add a little bit more here. And I'm putting this on top of makeup. I think that's really good, right? I'm super impressed with that. So yeah, I think you're gonna love them. They're way easier to blend than some of the other multitasking sticks that I've used. Let's add a little bit more blush. I just wanna like see what this looks like if I build it up, because it is the first time that I'm using this. Oh, it's like nice and kind of like glowy too. So you could add how much I added at the beginning and then I went over a powder, right? Well, you could actually go over with more at the end or just at the end to give you more of that kind of glowy finish to your skin. Super, super impressed with that. I don't know where I was going with, you know, adding some to the eyes. You could actually add it to the eyes. I mean, it has given a little bit of like a little touch of color, which I think looks good. I don't know what that was, touch. I, I don't know what that was that I just did, <laughs> just ignore it. If I don't already edit it. Yeah, so I'm really, really happy with that. Hopefully you've enjoyed this 10 minute tutorial and it's kind of given you an idea of what you could potentially do. I found that was very stressful. So I'm assuming you are very stressed right now. Watching me, that must have been stressful because it was stressful for me. I keep looking in the mirror because I'm actually so in love with this color, Rally. It's so good. I'm really, really impressed with that. And it's just made my skin look healthy. So yeah, make sure you head over to the description so you can check out all those products. And you know, they're not overly expensive either. So check it out and let me know if you have any questions about it. So I'm sending you loads of love wherever you are in the world. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button so that you never miss any of my future videos. Until the next video, take care and I'll see you soon.